Apple just delivered jaw-dropping announcements at WWDC 23, and everyone was definitely more focused on Apple Vision Pro, its features, pricing, and release date. Other topics included iOS 17 features, macOS, and others. But there was something else we missed, some sneak glimpses of the iPhone 15. Apple released a few hints about the iPhone 15, and the rumors of the iPhone 15 Ultra may be true. We also anticipate that the next iPhone 15 or 15 Ultra will be far superior to rumors. Let us investigate. As everyone is aware that Apple recently unveiled Apple Vision Pro, Apple's first ever VR headset with remarkable features. However, the price tag will make you think twice, if not 10 times, about acquiring this headset. Although there are numerous firms offering VR headsets with incredible features at an inexpensive price, Apple's headset will clearly be ahead of all those headsets and will contain better functionality. Without a doubt, Apple demonstrated several wonderful capabilities of Vision Pro, but there may be more to come that we are not aware of. In every official publication or event, Apple notifies us about Vision Pro, macOS, and iOS 17 enhancements, but not about the iPhone 15 and 15 Ultra. Keeping it a secret, or perhaps they want to surprise us, we already know about several upcoming iPhone 15 features from unauthorized sources, including as the new periscopic lens and Type-C port, but this time we obtain a handful of indications and clues about the next iPhone 15 from the recent WWDC event and other sources. So let's get started and see how many of the rumors and leaks we've all been hearing are true. First, it was speculated that Dynamic Island would be included in the next iPhone 15 models, including non-pro variants. Dynamic Island, which was originally presented by Apple on the iPhone 14, is a new feature that will undoubtedly be carried over to the upcoming iPhones. This time, however, it is open to both pro and non-pro models. It is confirmed on Apple's iOS 17 official page. Even on non-pro models, every phone has a dynamic island instead of a notch. So the iPhone 14 is the last model with a notch, and we won't see it again. Obviously, it's a new function in the iPhone, and Apple is unlikely to remove it very soon. Apple, like previous models, will use this capability for a long period. With the passage of time and software updates such as the impending iOS 17, Apple will undoubtedly enhance the island and make it more seamless. The second thing we know for certain is that Apple may remove the mute button from the future iPhone. How can we say it? According to Apple's most current official video about the Vision Pro, the headset will include a unique button dedicated to the camera only. Instead of hunting for a camera app, you may simply tap that button and begin recording photographs and movies. Similarly, Apple may employ this technology in iPhone 15 Pro models. It is also believed that the cameras on the iPhone 15 Pro models will be enhanced, allowing them to produce more detailed shots and films that reveal gorgeous angles of images. This will improve image quality and allow you to shoot 3D photos. iPhones already have a built-in LiDAR scanner that can be used to take 3D pictures, but only through specific apps. However, with iPhone 15 Pro models, this feature may be present in the standard camera without the need for a third-party app. If this happens, it will undoubtedly be amazing. The third thing we noted about Apple Vision Pro is that it can be controlled using hand gestures. This could be a hint at the wonderful capabilities that will be featured in iPhone 15 Pro variants. Yes, you can operate your iPhone with hand movements. Other mobile providers attempted the same thing, but it did not proceed as planned. By incorporating this technology inside the iPhone, Apple may surprise all companies and audiences. If Apple produces such things, it may save Apple, as there are some rumors that the iPhone may fail due to the lack of new things and Apple may cease producing iPhones for some time after the release of the iPhone 15 Ultra. Aside from that, we saw in the official Vision Pro video that it can be controlled with the eyes. Simply use your eyes to pick apps and perform other tasks, however, this may not be available for the iPhone right now. But if this happens, Everyone will be surprised. The next thing we'll go over is center stage. What exactly is center stage? I'm sure many of you are already aware of this and have used it on your iPads and iPhones. This functionality is ideal for conference calls and online business meetings. It is a webcam gadget that adjusts the camera angle automatically to ensure that you are in the frame. When linked to a studio display, it turns your iPhone or iPad into a webcam. However, despite being available on both the iPhone and the iPad, this function only works with the iPad's front camera and not the iPhone's. On the iPhone, this capability is only available for the rear camera. However, I believe it is essential to have this feature for the iPhone's front selfie camera. This function may be accessible on the future iPhone 15. You may be asking why we are comparing or judging the future iPhone 15 features based on Apple Vision Pro. 
Since the beginning of this year, we have all been hearing many rumors about the demise of the iPhone and its replacement with other Apple future products such as VR headsets, AR glasses, even Apple's car. And you can see that one of the goods, such as Apple's VR headset, is no longer a rumor and has been confirmed. Apple Vision Pro has just arrived with a bang. Instead of focusing on how it will end iPhones, consider how it can save iPhones. If the long-awaited rumor is now proven, we can also infer that the iPhone 15 Ultra and its incredible features are true. Apple is doing an excellent job with Vision Pro, delivering fantastic features such as hand and eye gesture controls, stunning display and quality, and so on. However, if we wish to hold this thing, we must clearly spend a hefty sum of $3,500. If Apple can achieve this, it will be a step closer to the actuality of the iPhone 15 Ultra, rather just innocuous rumors. However, if we want the iPhone 15 Ultra, which is distinct from the previous iPhone lineup, we will undoubtedly have to pay a premium for the capabilities of the 15 Ultra. If Apple introduces some fantastic features in the Vision Pro, it is obvious that the same brilliant features will be used in the iPhone to make it more connected to the Apple Vision Pro. If Apple is building up anticipation by unveiling the Apple Vision Pro, they will not disappoint by bringing the same old iPhone this year. If Apple is innovating and creating a revolution, it will be included into other Apple devices, not only the Vision Pro. We can also expect the iPhone 15 or 15 Ultra to have some additional features associated with the Vision Pro, separating it from prior iPhones. However, no one is aware of this. Apple is unusual. Sometimes it delivers something well above our wildest dreams and other times it delivers far less. So for the time being, we must wait and watch what occurs next but we're hoping for an onslaught of fantastic features. This concludes today's video. What are your thoughts on the Apple Vision Pro with the iPhone 15 Ultra? Please leave your comments in the section below. Also, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video.